But you know, why do you bother worrying? Amen. You can't add a single minute to your life without worrying. I have never worried in my life a situation better. Not one time. I was almost going to tell all of their business. This place was getting ready to fire me, right? And, and, and I knew they were getting, I mean, I knew they were getting ready to fire me. Have you ever been where well, you knew you was getting ready to get fired? Oh, yeah. So you one of them good employees. She said, uh-uh, uh -huh. I, I go to work on time. I, you know, my, my time clock good. See, there are those kinds of employees. You know what I'm saying? There are other employees who we good in the interview. <laughs> I mean, we give a heck of an interview. Um, and, and that would be more me. I, I'm real good in the interview. Yes, I'll be here 10 minutes early. Of course, 15 minutes early. <laughs> Why wouldn't I? Of course I do. And, and, and I say all this stuff that's not true, right? <laughs> that's absolutely not true. But I knew they were getting ready to fire me. And do you know what I did? I worried myself to death and worried myself until I got sick. And do you know I stayed sick for about a week and a half? And do you know what happened at the end of that? They fired me anyway. They fired me anyway. It was the same thing, I remember, I'll tell this, I'm so open with y'all, it's so funny how open I am with y'all. I remember I was getting ready to go through my divorce. I, I was worried. I said, I said, Lord, I don't want to get divorced. I, I, don't, I don't want to get divorced. I didn't want her, I just didn't want to be married. What was the whole idea? I, I wanted to keep my marriage together. And, and I prayed, and I prayed, and I prayed, and I prayed. You know what happened? I, I, I still got my divorce. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, I, I got pulled over one time. And I had something in the trunk. I won't get into it. <laughs> I won't get into it. But, but I, and, and, and I sat in that police, and he said, okay, sir, I'll be right back, Mr. Johnson. And he tapped the hood of my car, which if you know anything about <laughs> going to jail, that means you're going to jail. But, but he tapped the hood of my car, and he walked back to his car. And then before I knew it, he had walked to, to, to the back where, where I had my little issue, as we call it. And then and, and, and he started looking through the trunk, and that whole time I'm doing this, and I'm shaking, and I'm worried. Do you know what happened? I still went to jail. <laughs> but I'm worried so good. <laughs> I mean, I'm worried hard. I said, mm, I'm going to think about this one. Mm. You know, that, that strain kind of worry, it didn't do anything. I might as well, you pray for commercial, you might as well have a VA. I, I might as well have relaxed. I'm, I literally, when that man was searching my trunk, I should have helped him. Look, don't tear all that up. It's right here. You're <laughs> moving all this stuff around. I mean, come on, man. I gotta clean all this up later. You know what I'm Do you understand what I'm saying? Worry is a pointless emotion. I, I don't know if I can pound that into you because worry now is subconscious for you. It is something that you do without having to think about doing it. So you'll be worrying and not even know that you've done it. But I want you to remember this week, the border that you're securing, excuse me, that you're securing, that's hard to say, is I do not worry. Get this part, even if it looks like you should be worried. Even if it looks, watch this, especially if it looks like you should be worried. I want you to flip that brain chemistry because your brain chemistry will tell you, oh crap, I'm supposed to be worried and everything in your brain goes off. The chemicals associated with that thought start to break down into your body and all of a sudden you start to feel something. And all of a sudden, now you're walking around, oh, I'm just gonna work. Oh, I'm just gonna work. It ain't gonna change nothing. Stop. I work with addicts all day long and they come in. I'm just worried I ain't gonna get my license back. First of all, <laughs> we worry about that later. <laughs> we got a lot of stuff to do first. You know, you understand what I'm saying? Worry is a pointless emotion. 